Good morning guys from Green Island. We just woke up in our freelance tent here and now it's time to check out the view. Ooh. Nice. Good morning guys from beautiful, beautiful Green Island. Lisa and me, we just woke up out of our tent down here. And as you can see, I bought a new piece of equipment, this camera gimbal right here. And I'm checking it out right now, if it works well. And check out this sunrise here. Woo. Yeah. Anthony has a really, really beautiful sunrise at his yard. Check it out. Wow, it's so nice. And in about an hour, we are heading off to the shore to catch some barracuda. And check this out. Come on. Yeah, man. Anthony no. just pulled out a huge barracuda out of the freezer. I went cut him up. Slice fish and put it down for later. We fry it nice. and have a good time. Yeah, man. yeah, man. That's what I was waiting for Simon to come to cut up this one. I cut up one already, but I have one more list. I'm gonna cut up this one right now. Oh, yeah, you bend it first, <laughs> give him a spine treatment. Yes. <laughs> We get in there now. Get the slice and pretty, you know. That is how the people them like to buy it, and we can cook it and make rice and peas and barracuda. So we have to cut it up very nice. We can entice the people them, but them love it when the slice them are big in the plate. This one we're eating today, these slices after this big one. What are you yeah, gonna man. make with it? I want to excavate it, fry it and excavate it and make some rice and peas. And we want to pepper and spicy and nice. Nice. Everybody, one piece of the barracuda head. So every bag what I made in two pounds, three pounds, we have to put a piece of the head inside. Else not then said, why you give away the fish head? I need fish head too, and I love fish head. And them love it, so we have to share it. The both of us can get it to eat. So the whole bucket, how much would you sell it for? The whole bucket, I would sell it for 15,000. 15,000? Yes. It's not too bad. This barcode is very big and very thick and very heavy. So now I bust in his head now. So if we are lucky today, guys, then we may be catch our own barracuda today and Lisa Baguan. Baguan. what are you doing uh, I will get some coffee now okay coffee time mm -hmm. so now Anthony is cleaning the fish over here yeah man freelance outdoor kitchen yes man freelance Free yeah man yeah man wash it off now make it clean then I bag it up after And by the way, Anthony is a spare fishing legend. What is your record, your barracuda record? My barracuda record, I caught 13. That's how I catch it in the season. Yes, man. Yeah, man. One of a kind barracuda hunter. <laughs> yeah, man. I'm Bro. excited to see that. So today, we're going to go and catch 
maybe one or two today for working today. But why why we leaving the time when we want to leave? Actually my time is six o'clock and we should in the water and start to hunt already. Right. But today is a movie day. Yeah man. And we're going to make a movie and try to catch some back with the till maybe 12, 1 o'clock in the day. So we're going to have a good day in Nigel today. Yeah man. Yeah man. At home, sweet home. Yes, that is the hotel where we're going. Yeah man. Today is a bit, little bit of a late start. Normally Anthony goes into the into the ocean at 6 a.m. And yeah, I'm excited. We are driving with the car to Negril. Then we're jumping into the water. And yeah, we will see if we are actually able to find some barracuda. Anthony just finished slicing the fish and now he's actually preparing breakfast right here in the kitchen. Some egg with bread. Yes, man. Egg and bread today. Not a belly full, just a little slight thing because we don't want to chew in the water. True. We have to know what we eat to go in the water. Yeah, man. Hello. Hello. Hello, we have to move. Come on. Anthony is in a rush. <laughs> yeah, if I want to go and catch barracuda today, so we have to go. So man is bleaky. I'll just turn out in a, a beautiful morning. So we like to go early in the morning to catch barracuda. Yeah. Lisa, look at your back. Oh, thank you, Anthony. Super. Super duper. Super, super. Mm -hmm. Some eggs, tomatoes, toast. Perfect. And we have enough energy for the day. This is for you, Simon. Thank you so much. Me, me have to, me have to me eat a lot, you know, so I have mm -hmm. to make mine big. <laughs> <laughs> also, I have a nice cup of coffee right here. Mm, nice coffee. And now we're already jumping into the car, heading off to Negril and go for some epic barracuda fishing. <laughs> we're leaving Anthony's yard now, off to Negril. And check out the view right here. It's really smoky. And the sun just came up, had some nice breakfast. Locking up the gate. Um, yeah, man. Now ready we to go. roll? Yeah, yes, man. man. Ready to roll now. Go to the ocean to hunt barracuda today. Yeah, man. Yeah, man. And also another thing, guys, here at Antony's, it's so much more hot than down in Portland. It's crazy. Now it's, what time do we have? 8 a.m. And it's, it already feels like 30 degrees centigrade. Whew, absolute badness. And Anthony has lots of fins. Yes, man, fin and mask. Fin and mask. But the, the gun is in Negril, so we pick up the gun and we go to Negril. Yeah, I'm excited to see his spare fishing gear. We finally arrived in Negril and now we're going straight into the water, guys. Wow, check out this view. As it looks like, there's a massive platform up here where you can jump into the water from. Whoa. It's real deep though. Check it out. Wow, sick. <laughs> I love it. Nigel is kind of nice with all these cliffs where you can go into the water from. And the view. Wow, and all the buildings here. It looks real, real nice. That's his spare gun. It looks pretty professional. Most Jamaicans, they build their own spare guns, but this one is not that freelance. <laughs> I think you can't, you can't really shoot Barracuda with your own spare gun, right? What do you think? No. Actually, I could make a spear gun and... I used to make a spear gun and use it. Mm -hmm. But I see a lot of guys have the original ready-made hangar and I feel like it's very sweet and want to enter the competition too so I buy one and use it so and I, I like how it feel this mm -hmm. is the original champion 
and it's very sweet and nice. <laughs> yes, man. Super nice. Yeah, I'm excited to see this so thing in go. action. Yeah, well, now we go. And I have to put this underwater housing now on my camera, and then we're ready for some barracuda. Like yeah. it, it never, it never looked like this yesterday. Yeah, it's not, not, not that rough today. Eh? Yeah, today calm. good current, calm, and the current is going down now. I can see it. Mm -hmm. So now we're going to kill barracuda. <laughs> 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 he loves it. Oh, nice. Okay. I'm Lisa, excited to see that. I hope you you're can gonna kill a barracuda Me? as well. <laughs> <laughs> so now I throw this one off in the water. Me, I have to go. Ah, uh, you have to go? Yes. So when you throw it in the water, if the current is going down the sea, the back will turn around and you can know. And if the current is going up the sea, you can know. So that's how he so. checks where the current is going yes. really clever yes nice and now i think i'm gonna jump from right up here right in there and it's a little bit scary <laughs> i'm excited and two more guys from chucky's yard are actually arriving today here in negril and they're gonna come camp with us tonight as it looks like Ja, war das super nice today.
We just made it back on land and yes. we got one. Awesome! Yes. Super nice! Yeah, man! Yeah! <laughs> hey! Nice one, man! Yeah, man! And look at the teeth! Look at this teeth! Awesome! Yeah, man! It's super nice! We did it! Big one! Yeah, man! <laughs> and this is the great gun! This is the great Barracuda gun, see? Yeah, man! Yeah, man. Nice, man. Awesome! Nice, and yeah. now, now we're gonna rinse off the salt water. There's yes. a, a fresh water shower right there. And yeah, maybe we will have this one for dinner. Yeah, this one for dinner. Nice. <laughs> Catch and yes. cook. That's a oh, it's, it, it's huge. <laughs> After our very successful spare fishing session, we're heading back to Anthony's yard to start preparing the barracuda that he caught just a couple hours ago. So, yeah, man. Lisa, you ready? Okay. I'm ready. We're going home with the barracuda to cook it later. That's the yes, plan. Yes, man. That is the plan. So now we put him in the car. Good catch today. Yeah. That's how you transport a barracuda in Jamaica, guys. We take nearly the entire trunk. It's so big. How much pound is that? 16 pound. 16 pound? Yes. Oof. I just say that, but maybe it could be 17, but I just said 16. Yeah, very we can heavy. weigh it later. Huh? Later we go home, we weigh it. But it's a very big one, it's very thick. Yes, man. Now we're going home. Yeah, man. All right, let's drive back to Green, Green Island. All right, hold it for a while. Ah, Lisa can hold the barracuda. <laughs> Do you yeah. like it? No. <laughs> I don't like the smell. Uh, <laughs> all right. Okay. No, we're heading out home now. And the fins, we leave it in there? Yeah, we leave yeah. it now. We think that's safe. Okay. Oh, close, yeah, close, close it. Close it. Yeah. We're back in Green Island and now we're heading back up to the property and then we're gonna do some yard man style cooking barracuda edition super nice 16 pounds see yeah man, we've made it back to the yard <laughs> and we're weighing the barracuda that he caught and it's exactly as he said 16 pounds 16 pounds <laughs> yeah man i tell you i know the weight man yes man wow it was big now i put him in the fridge Put him across and have him lay down. Lay down like catch him up like that. Yeah, let him take a yes, rest. Yes. Little rest. Yes. So now I'm going to organize myself now to start to cook. I have some fish to fry, have some rice and peas to make, so it's going to take me a while, but I want to get everything together and then I just run through it so fast and quick. That's a far right. Oh, yeah. yeah man, watch your head and it will be scared. I take it down. Don't use it no more.